Hi guys, my name is Gina Jonesville and welcome to a walkthrough of the multi-story renovations quest in Sims Free Play. This quest is available from level 17 and once you are able to complete it, you will get this pop-up. So it says, new quest available, multi-story renovations. Renovate your Sims houses, create multi-story houses, complete with fire poles, staircases, elevators, escalators and more. So there is a six day time limit on this quest. So when we complete this quest, as it says, we will unlock the ability to renovate and give your Sims multi-story houses. If we complete it within the six-day time limit, we will unlock the elevators and escalators pack. So definitely something worth doing, I think. The first thing we need to do is to build the community centre. So the community centre has been approved for construction on the town map. Rumour has it that the community centre is unlike any building seen so far, including dedicated woodwork stations where dolls can spring to life, as well as karate and ballet lessons, so go build it. So let's head out onto our town map. Once you're out onto your town map, the community centre is kind of top left corner, it'll be flashing for you. Go ahead and click on it. The requirements for me are that it'll take 18 hours, 12 minutes, 150,000 simoleons, I'll need 10 sims at a town value of 150,000. As always, when you're building on your town map, that could be different for you depending upon how many buildings you've already got in your town. So this is a place for your adult sims to practice woodworking and for your preteen sims to learn karate and ballet. The more they practice, the better they get and the more rewards you'll receive. So let's go ahead and get that started. So our new community centre is now built, so let's go ahead and click on it. And there we go, task complete, build the community centre. So the next thing that we need to do now is to send a sim to the community centre. It's built, send a sim to the community centre for the grand opening. So let's click on the community centre and go inside. And we will whistle over a sim from the sim tracker. Send a sim to the community centre. Completed. Now we need to talk to Wumples. The community centre hired Simtown's greatest mascot, Wumples the Water Safe Bunny, to promote the grand opening. Talk to her and find out more about the community centre. So let's click on Wumples and talk to for two minutes. There we go, we have finished talking to Wumples. Now we need to press look upstairs whilst at the community centre. Wumples says the community centre is a two story building. All you have to do to look upstairs is press the look upstairs arrow located on the top right of the screen. Press it now. Okay, so on near the top right it is flashing for us over on the right hand side here. So let's click on that and that goes up a floor and that is task completed. So now as you can see, we can see the top floor. Now we need to carve magnum opus. A dedicated woodworking area is upstairs. Your sim doesn't want to just practice woodworking. They want to carve something super special. Get an adult sim to carve their magnum opus on a woodworking bench. Note, find the new woodworking benches upstairs at the community centre. So if we click on a woodworking bench and carve magnum opus is 12 hours and 30 minutes. Let's get that started. We've finished carving the magnum opus. Now we need to see Wumples for psychoanalysts. Your sim did such an amazing job that they started to wonder whether supernatural forces were at play. Ghosts, woodworking aliens. Your sim is freaked out, but luckily there's someone downstairs dressed as a bunny who is willing to provide free counseling. Get a psychoanalyst from the bunny at the community center. I do apologize for that drilling or whatever is going on in the background. So let's click on the bunny and psychoanalyst for seven minutes. We've seen Wumples for some psychoanalysts. Now we need to share ideas with Wumples. During the counselling session with Wumples, your sim had an idea. It has something to do with wood and floors. Get your adult sim to share ideas with Wumples. So let's click on Wumples again and share ideas is three minutes, 30 seconds. We finished sharing our ideas with Wumples. Now we need to call home store hotline by phone. That's it. If the community centre has a second floor, maybe more floors could be added to houses too. Have a sim call the home store hotline by phone. Keep asking and they'll offer more floors for homes in no time. So let's go ahead and head to a house. And if we click on our phone, call hotline is nine hours on this three star phone. The next thing that we need to do is to browse the internet. They did it after talking to a home store staff member. They were convinced to add staircases and multi-story homes. Apparently it is going to take a lot of coding and art time, whatever that is. Maybe it's time to find out what the home store staff likes to eat. They're going to need sustenance. Browse the internet.
Let's browse the internet for 4 minutes and 30 seconds. This is only a 2 star computer though, so you can do that quicker with a 3 star. There we go, we've finished browsing the internet. The next thing we need to do is to bake banana bread. Bananas, apparently the home store staff loves to eat them. Add a ton of sugar for that over-energised work ethic we need and bam, banana bread. Bake some banana bread in the oven. So let's click on a stove and go in baking and banana bread is down here somewhere. Banana bread, there we go, 20 hours to bake banana bread. And I do have a feeling that you can actually do this early. You wanted to start this kind of at the beginning of the quest and then save the banana bread before you click on it. I think that will save you a little bit of time here. The next thing you need to do is to check email. The banana bread went over well. Maybe somebody who works at the home store has sent you a thank you note. Check your email. Let's click on a computer and check email for 40 seconds. We've checked the emails. Now we need to have a creative chat with a sim. You have an email from the home store. We need some new staircase design ideas pronto. Can you help us? Perhaps your sim could discuss some woodworking ideas with a friend. Have a sim creative chat with a sim. So with one sim selected, click on another sim and have a creative chat top right side for 2 minutes and 48 seconds. We finished our creative chat with a sim. Now we need to call Homestore Hotline by phone. Your sims had some great ideas for the staircase designs. Call the hotline by phone again and share them. So let's click back on the phone and call the hotline for 9 hours. Now we need to talk to Wumples. The home store says they're close to finishing the staircases and will incorporate the new ideas. Tell Wumples about the great news. Wumples the water safe bunny is downstairs at the community centre. So let's head on over to the community centre. We need to whistle a sim over. Then click on Wumples and talk for two minutes. We've finished our little chat to Wumples. Now we need to see Wumpels, the psychoanalyst, again. Wumpels thinks the supernatural forces from earlier may have had something to do with the success of the staircases. Your sim is having another panic attack and needs a follow-up psychoanalyst session. Have a psychoanalysis with Wumpels. So let's click on Wumpels again and a psychoanalysis for seven minutes. We have seen Wumpels for another psychoanalysis. Now we need to have three sims dancing to a stereo. The home store just delivered everything needed to, to add additional floors to houses. Get three sims to celebrate by dancing to a stereo. I have a feeling this is the last thing that we need to do. Let's go over to a home with a stereo. And then just click on the stereo and we can choose anything. The pop, the Latin, indie, electronica for 2 minutes, 24 seconds. And if we get three sims doing that, so join in and then join in. And then as soon as they start to do that, that is task completed. You don't have to have finished it. And that is quest complete. You've unlocked the ability to renovate and build multi-storey houses. The tools you need are under the floor construction category of the home store. And congratulations, you've just unlocked the elevators and escalators pack. Don't forget to take a picture after putting them in your house. Your friends will be super jealous. So that is our limited time prize. So let's take a look at what we unlocked and what we won by completing the quest. So obviously we can now add more floors. At the moment we can only have one story buildings. Once you complete the quest you can add up to five more. So if you go into the floor construction section of the home store that is where you'll be able to add floors. They are very expensive. The second floor is 300,000, third floor is 500,000, fourth floor 800,000 and a fifth floor costs a million simoleons so it is very very expensive to add additional floors. In your home store you now have a stairs section which is where the stairs, the fire poles, the escalators and the elevators all live. If you don't complete the quest in time you will still unlock the stairs and the fire poles. There are several different ones as you can see. To place stairs you have to obviously have an upstairs already there so because I haven't gone upstairs there I can't place the stairs so if I go ahead and build an upstairs floor construction build a second floor and then build a big room up here on the second floor so now I can build my stairs we can place them there and then there's also a couple of different fire poles which I'm not a massive fan of the fire poles but they do come in useful 
if you have not got much space if you're working with quite a small build. The prize for completing within the time limit are a couple of elevators which honestly I was really excited about getting them but I've never really used them in my town as you can see they take up quite a lot of space they're kind of a three by two if you place one on the bottom floor and then obviously there's one above because that's how an elevator works you go up and down on it there are four different kinds the rickety elevator the arc deco elevator the haunted elevator and the ritzy elevator the ritzy i think cost 20 lps and then we also get a couple of escalators and i really quite like the escalators my favorite is the rainbow escalator which is 20 lp let me show you a sim using the escalator so they actually obviously work like an escalator the sim gets on them and it moves up it's pretty cool i mean you'd never have an escalator in your house but pretty awesome always trapped you can't do it anywhere <laughs> but yeah they are the prizes and what we unlocked by completing this quest the next quest that becomes available to us is teenagers so i'll put a link down below and on the screen now once we have done that one thanks so much for watching don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed subscribe if you're new if you've got any questions about the quest or about sims free play in general don't forget to leave them down below in the comments and either myself or another simmer will do our best to try and help you out thanks for watching and i'll see you guys soon for a new video bye